Hey there guys, Conquertron here, and welcome back to another part 3 of Skylanders Bumble Blast only of Swap Force. Last episode, we did chapters 4, 5, technically 6 because the boss fight counts as one, I don't know why. So technically we did another 3, I don't really count it though, but today we go, oh we get to go to Motleyville, I thought that actually came later. Alright, 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 Motleyville. Motleyville is one of the best levels in Swap Force, if, um, and one of the best levels in Skylanders overall. Generally accepted by the community as being one of the top levels, period. But so, yeah. It's also just a really good one, in my opinion. Definitely top five. Probably second, because Rampart Ruins is my favorite. I'll get to it at some point. Um, so yeah, hopefully we need to skip this and move right along. Thing is, there's two boss fights in this one. There's Whiskers, well there's Whiskers Part 1, then there's Whiskers Part 2, and then there's Baron Von Shellface over here. So, we'll just have to see. I'm actually pretty sure life might be strong during Whiskers fight plus two. I don't actually know. Hopefully we can get this over with really quickly though. Ow. I actually know that there's corn outside of the gate right here after we defeat Whiskers. Oh no! Okay. Right. Boom boom boom. Bye bye. The bees are still chasing him. Alright. Alright. Just... Another reason Motleyville is really good is because that's where you get um, Sharpfin. And Sharpfin was the only character in Swap Force to not fill a role. Like, Flynn is Flynn. Tessa is supposed to replace Callie, but Callie, but Tessa is actually a, a one-up off of Callie. And that's really the only one. Like, there's, uh... Um... Shoot. There's the Hit Bros, Tuck, and... Um... Gorm. Tuck and Gorm. Uh, Gorm was the Persephone, Tuck was the Auric. Auric wasn't really there a whole lot, but I prefer Auric because he's the original. Obviously, I prefer Persephone. Oh, goodness. Um. Uh, and then, I mean, I guess you could say that Sharpman kind of placed Flynn's role or like worked alongside Flynn for that one. Because they both take you places, so I would call it a co-op. They both do it at the same time, I suppose. But I mean, if you had to put them in a role, that's where I'd put them. And then there's Rufus. Ru there's no point in Rufus the Doofus, but there's no point in Rufus. He just talks for five minutes before you can go on to your next thing. By then, you could do whatever you want. Alright. Mm -hmm. Boing! Yeah, I, I really like the grind rails in Swap Force. That's one thing that Swap Force did good. Er, yeah. They introduced grind rails. And personally, I don't have a problem with these grind rails, but the ones in Imaginators I don't like a whole lot. Because you have to like, m this one, I'm just moving my stick from left to right, but in the other one, you like, you have to move it left to right and jump at the same time, so. Yeah. And then, but then they also put in fishing, and fishing is only in this game for a reason, because nobody liked it. Or at least I don't think anybody liked it. I didn't like it. And then there's the turn sections. Uh, they kind of improved upon it, and deproved upon it at the same time because they improved upon it by making the hitboxes a lot better they made the little thingy bob bopper a lot bigger the crosshair or whatever it is a lot bigger but then they also made it so your turret doesn't have health like there's no turret health if you get hit that goes directly into your skylanders health instead of just going to the turret and if you lose the turret then um, you just have to do it again. But, 
In this one, if you lose the turn, if you die, then you've got to do it again. Actually, I'm I don't think you have to do it again, but you lose your Skylander, which is dumb and stupid. Big stupid. Alright. Eh. Ow. Motleyville is another one of those levels that just gives you a bunch of food. Ow. Shoot. It looks like you need it too. Ugh. Come on, get this guy. Get this guy. Dang it. It's a little too late on my this thing. The little hack thing. You mean I did all that for a treasure chest I didn't even need? I have some food for being my stupid self. Oh, Alright, thank you. Thank you for answering my prayers, Skylanders, Lord. Okay. There's a good one here. Because unlike the tournaments, I don't have to defeat every person if I don't want to. And I don't want to. How's that? Three, two, one. Alright. Alright, this little bit's actually kind of cool, you go in a little circle. What's a Dorfroffle? I don't know. Alright. Cannon shop. Or, yeah, the cannon shop, I guess. I don't know. He just lends you a cannon. Cannon shop, you don't actually have to pay anything for it. Alright. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Do 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 Alright, I forget if there's enemies in here. Yep, definitely. Can't touch it. I'm pretty sure there's one of those slam shot guys on the other side of this. The one was with the shield. Yeah. This guy again trying to Cause he tried doing it in the other level two, Rampart Ruins. I killed him on my way out. What does that say to you about Bumbleboss, huh? Alright, Gibbs. Yeah, At least pressure that Gibbs. Yep. I'm actually pretty sure why you're trying to push up this thing. A bunch of choppies come after you. This is really annoying. Because, like, there's no point to him. They're really useless. <laughs> Bang. I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing the next one. Because the next one's actually a pretty long level. This one's actually a decently long level as well. So, we'll see. Probably not. I just want to get this recorded today. And I'll be content-ish. Because in order for me to have enough videos for the rest of the wait days that I'm off, I've got to record five videos a day for the next three days because we leave on Thursday. So I've got today, which I this is my fifth one, and then uh, dang it, I forget. Uh, Monday I gotta record five, Tuesday I gotta record five, and Wednesday I've gotta record five. So that's 20 videos in total. That's a lot of recording. Usually I only record two to three videos a day. And that's not including 101s either. Oh, there's some corn over here. Yeah, that's not including 101s or the tier lists, so we'll just have to see what happens. You might only get like one or two 101s over that period, it depends. Thing is, I gotta schedule all this crap too. Usually I can only take like posting one video, one or two or three videos a day because I, I don't, I'm, I don't have a problem, you know, making titles and stuff like that. It's the, oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's the, um, uh, shoot, typing up the description. Title, fine. Same as always, usually. Uh, can't get me this time. Got me that time. Um, titles, fine. Uh, what else is it? Um, description. I don't really like typing up description. Like, they're already really short, like one to two sentences, but I don't like typing it up. Um, most of my thumbnails, I just change a few things and that's it. 
The only ones that I really make a completely new thumbnail and not like a template is the rankings. I usually try to arrange them in a different, the pictures in a different order each time. Um, but other than that, like the reviews 101, they're the same. Uh, the locks, they're the same. I just gotta change like a number. Solo runs, all I'm gonna have to do is change a number. So, yeah. And then, soul links, up every once in a while I gotta put an X on, to, depending on who died. But, yeah. And then there's not even a number on that one. Because I forgot to put the number on during design phase, so. And I don't really, and there really wasn't any room for one either, but. I actually quite like it without the number. Although, I like my things neat and tidy. I like numbers, that way I can watch them in order. I like them in all, I like everything. In, like when I, like when, when I watch other people, like and I'm watching a series, like front to back or something, I want a playlist, A to Z, one, one, two, three, until whatever. Whoa, whoa, jeez. I thought that would've came up quicker. Um, seriously. Um, there's something else. Yeah. I also like, like every, I'm pretty sure 97 or like 95% of every single one of my videos on the channel is in a playlist. Whether it's like a collection or a discussion or like a random video. Like I've got one called random video, which is just like one-offs. Um, so yeah, I like, I've got the creation crystal um, showcases. Like, I've only made two of those, and those are pretty random. So they could have gone in random, but I put them in their own separate category. So, yeah. What, what are we at? 12? We're blazing through this pretty quickly, I'm not gonna lie. But I do think we're only getting through one episode, because I'm on a time crunch, and again, pretty long. Same with the next episode. The next episode, I don't think I'm going to be on such a time crunch. I might be. But even then, like, it's... The twisty tun tunnels are all is already a really long level combined with the boss fight at the end, which is decently long. So, yeah. Ow. Was I hit by something? Alright. Yeah, life is strong here. So this is just going to go even quicker than last time. Upsies, upsies, upsies. Right. Get out of here. Oh crap. At least I can still shoot him like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like it when they does the little laser thing because I can they can attack, but I can still attack them at the same time. I just gotta dodge them. I don't like it when they do this. Because they're invincible and I I said earlier that I don't like I think it was in a last episode that I said I don't like enemies that um, can damage me but I can't damage them. Boss fights is a different story because they're supposed to be like that. But like those spinny dudes, they can hit me but I can't hit them. Like, come on. That's just rude. Actually, I do need the experience. I forget. I think we started out this entire series at chapter... Uh, level 14, maybe like 14 and a half. Now we're at 16, so definitely making it. Just got some more health too. Alright. And we're off. Probably gonna blow ourselves up in the process. What? Oh, I was confused. I didn't actually know that was a ramp. I'm not actually sure if we came across the part where there's like that greeble next to us that like ramps, ramps off an edge. I'm pretty sure it's coming up. The thing is that it's really hard to watch it because, you know, you're trying to do this and like this is the hardest bit. Alright, sweet. Baron von Shellshock. Man, you got a lot of these gear golems. Earth gear golem, dude. Ow. Took that one right to the face. Surprised that- Why didn't that guy even fire? 
I'm gonna leave the food there until it becomes more uh, like if I get damaged again or something. I don't know. All right, maybe I'll just grab another one. Do 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 do. Thing is, after we do this episode, we're gonna be halfway through the series at episode three. Or at least I'm pretty sure it's episode three. Yeah. So we're gonna be halfway through this this entire series at episode three. Just think about that. That is wicked. In fact, if we keep this up, actually no. I think usually I try to keep the same speed, uh, solo run and Tron lap going at the same time. As of recording this, I don't actually know what happened. Thing is, there's only two episodes left, whether I like it or not, because. Even if I do lose against Golden Queen, that's only one. But if I do beat Golden Queen, the final episode is episode 18, whether I like it or not. And I've got 16 is probably going to be long out. 17 and probably 18 are out at this point too. So you guys probably know, but I don't at this point. Man, this is the fourth year golem at this point. Jeez. How many of these things do you have? Crap. Ow. Mm. Alright, take out this guy. Mm. Alright, sweet. If you want to know why I don't reset my characters, is because... Like, I know some people reset their characters. I don't, because I don't, like... Other people, like... <coughs> they can, like, go out of their way, or, like, they have the time to do this, but I don't really have a whole lot of time. I hardly have enough time to do... Just keep posting, like, one video a day. Because sometimes I don't even get to record. So, like, when I record, like, twice a day, that really helps. Especially when I get to record three times a day. But today is five times. Like, probably, I'm probably going to do a sixth one, too, just to stay ahead. Because I'm not even sure, 100% sure, if I'm going to be able to record tomorrow. I mean, hopefully I will. Because, you know, that would really help so I can have videos for you guys. But, like, jeez. I'm probably also going to have to do some calculations. In I recorded the three latest original tournaments um, before this. And then went and recorded last Bumble Blast filler run. And then this one. Uh... I forget what I was talking about. So I might have to record another OG tournament at some point. Maybe. And then maybe another Bumble Blast to learn. I have to do, like I said, I gotta run the calculations. I probably do. Definitely do. Now I think about it, I definitely do. I was just gonna record two of every episode, everything. But now that I think about it, I think I've gotta record another tournament. And then the solo run. Another solo run after this. So. I'm probably gonna do that after this. Yeah. I was thinking that I probably could, because I I have the time to record the next to do. I think I have the time to do Twisty Tunnels. But after that, I don't think I'll be able to record another one, so. That, what can I do for you today? If you, if you run a channel, you know what I'm talking about, but I think I'm just going to have to run one. Just one for today. Usually I'd go for two, but like I said, I'm on time crunch. So, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of the Bumble Blast Swap Force Solar Run. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time.